being able to innovate and having the tools to do that, to, to take what I imagine and, and bring it to life, is something that, that I think the engineering school is helping me to um, accomplish. And that's something that I'm really excited about. You've got friendships with professors and you usually will see them more than once. You've got technical assistants in labs who are students themselves who are still pretty close to you in age. And they've just recently gone through the same things themselves. So all around you've got a lot of people that you can relate to and who are very helpful. What makes it somewhat unique from other computer science or computer engineering programs is that it's a very nice blend of software and hardware. I think what's unique about it at Santa Clara would be the fact that we offer our students the opportunity to do a study abroad without extending their four-year graduation date. Also, they could just as easily do a co-op in industry, again, without extending their four-year graduation date. I think the most important thing that we have here in Santa Clara is, you know, a closer connection with the students. Our classes are small, so we know all the students, we know their names, we know who is doing well, who is not doing well. We actually watch them over the four years, and, and they get to actually come and work with us in projects, so we have, like, a closer relationship. They basically work with us, and when they have a problem, they come to us, and we help them out and they are able to actually participate in research in our group. So we, basically the attention that they get from the professors is a big difference between coming here and going to another school. In this past year, I had been working with my professor, um, Professor Figuera, on a portable help blog. And um, recently I, I had submitted a proposal to the Grace Hopper Conference for Women in Computing, and the proposal was accepted, and this past September, I got to fly out to Tucson and um, present my portable help blog to all kinds of people in technology, and it was really cool to um, share what I'd been working on for so long. Classes give you a lot of freedom for just creativity and what you write and what you do, um, and I think that translates really well to what you find, you know, when you're actually looking for a job and when you're working in a job. Um, I wasn't expecting the amount of freedom and creativity in uh, what I get to work on and what I get to do. So our program in CSE has introductory computing, um, high-level computing, low-level embedded systems kind of work. There's a certain amount of introduction to logic design and computer architecture. You can go into networking if you like that. You can go into areas that are closer to EE. Um, you can also emphasize web design. You can do game design. You can also do information assurance, which is an interesting area. It's uh, about network security and software security and protecting software and systems. Seniors at Santa Clara who are part of the engineering program have to complete a senior design project. So I developed a a movie called Opening Day, which is a big robot that stomps around and shoots at stuff uh, and falls over at the end, but it's a great experience. And now I'm applying that to my senior design project as a graphics artist and a conceptual artist. SU students are better equipped uh, in their educations because uh, in Jesuit missions, uh, in the philosophy of Jesuit missions, we are emphasizing on broad-based educations. So it's not just technical, but uh, students also uh, will be taught on ethical aspects, social aspects, and other influence on humanities, uh, you know, using their technologies. So uh, it is an education aiming for developing the whole person. It's not just technical alone. Although you are picking the field of CSE, you're not really limiting yourself that much, especially like I enjoy any coding in general, and so you can really do a lot with it. Um, I don't think I could have had an experience like this anywhere else just because of how well other students have gotten to know me and how well uh, my professors and advisors have gotten to know me. You can't really trade that for anything else.